Ooh, that looks expensive. A hole right there at the motor mount. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? That is not a window, that is a full sunroom. All right, guys, we are going back to CND Auto Tech to visit the Hulk because our buddy Chuck is going to put Hulk on the lift. I'm going to find out exactly ooh, how bad it is. I'm hoping it's not catastrophic. I don't know if the block is gone. It looks like it was. Maybe it's not. I'm, you know, I'm hoping that it's just a short block. It's going to be expensive either way. Um, speaking of that, um, I'm in the Raptor right now because. The Raptor giveaway actually ends. It's the only truck I have that's working. But uh, what we're gonna do is this. Uh, just a coincidence. <laughs> no, it's not. Uh, the mystery boxes are back, guys. Mystery boxes are back. Had a chance to win this Raptor here. Was a mystery box. Uh, now there were 300 entries and there's a little twist because the mystery boxes end on December 24th, Christmas Eve. Had a chance to win this Raptor. Help me gotta get some money in here for the block. Um, now you get to choose uh, the items. Not, you'll, there'll be a mystery uh, item, a bonus item, but you can get to choose uh, some of the stuff that's going to come in the box. So if you, you know, a kind of person that wants one or two boxes or more, you'll be able to um, pick um, some items this time. So it'll be less of a mystery, and you can you can that way you can plug and play some of your stuff if that makes sense. But let's go check on Hulk. Let's see what happens. Let's see how bad it is. That's a nice Mustang. If you guys don't know, Chuck just started this shop. He's very uh, well respected in the game, especially the Mustang, really fast game, like the GT500 and things. So he just started this shop. It's C&D Auto Tech, which is in Newcastle, Delaware. I'll put a link in the description. You can check it out. He's gonna do some stuff. We're gonna see it all and go from there. You are in uh, your background, you know, you built some of the fastest and baddest CT 500s in the world, so a couple, yeah. we're in the right place, and Hulk's in the right hands. And you just started this shop recently. Oh, I just moved to this location okay. recently. Okay, I've been doing this on my own for the last four years, and I've been in the industry for 12 years. So I, I built some of the, the quickest GT 500s out there. Some still holding records, even yeah, you know, six years later. So. We're in good hands. Yep. We're in the right place. Yep, absolutely. And uh, we'll put link down below, CND Auto Tech. Of course, he's super busy, as you can see. But uh, if you want it done right, especially your very fast GT 500s or Mustangs in general, there's a place to go. So this is the first time we're going to see it underneath, guys, um, because obviously it was on the tow truck, but now it's happening. So Chuck has even saved this for me. Yeah. I know. What if it's just a loose oil filter? <laughs> it's just a loose oil filter. That's it. Yeah. That was all. <laughs> oh gosh, guys. I'm a little nervous. All right. Now, Chuck's almost seven feet tall, so you can see this lift. It goes a lot higher. All right, what are we looking at? I do see. Ooh, Ooh that looks expensive. All good, all good. I don't even know if I can get this out. No. Oh yeah. You, you see that chunk right? Oh, that's, that's chunky. Right there. Yeah. I can hear that. Ooh. Oh wow. Wow. You know what that is? That's the top of the piston, isn't it? Very much so. 
Oh my gosh. That is the top of the pit. Oh gosh. This is not just this is not just a normal catastrophic. This is you, you see the the hole right there at the motor mount? Oh my gosh. This is not just a normal catastrophic. This is you, you, you see the the hole right there at the motor mount? Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? That is not a window, that is a full sunroom. Goodness gracious, guys, I don't know if you can see that. Ow. Let me turn off, I'll put on the, oh my gosh, that is, you can put your whole arm through there. Oh my goodness, this is gonna be so bad. That was the top of the piston, holy cow. Look at that, guys. Oh, the question is, is this the other half or is this the other piston? Oh my gosh. Let me see that. Good Lord. This is gonna, you know what this looks like? This is pinging and pogging a lot of places, guys. So this is not gonna be, ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Oh my gosh, this is going to be expensive. Trans. It's just going to be... Oh, there's the other hole. Oh, both sides. Okay. Oh, oh my gosh. Yeah, I can see it. Holy cow, I can see that. There's block. So we got pistons, blocks. Goodness gracious. This is I'm still in shock. <laughs> yeah. So we windowed both sides of the block. Pistons disintegrated, and then the rods were flapping around, and yeah. that's what put the holes in the side of the block. Well, got some flex seal with this. this thing. <laughs> oh man, this is definitely catastrophic. Now we got to hope the heads are okay. Ugh. That's probably the same. Piston. The same piston, okay. Seven or eight. Everyone always says it's seven or eight. It's probably, uh, it's either three or seven. I would think from where it is and where the hole is. Jeez. I, do you have an E85 tester? Cause I'll take I some, do not. I'll take some E85 with me and I'll test it just to double check if there was, man, that is, whew. And that's one hole there, guys. And then the other hole is basically on the same side, I think. Yeah. More block? More. Right there, guys. You can see that. There is the other hole. Yeah. You can see the light going through it. Kind of lucky you didn't catch fire. Oh, all that oil on the hot headers, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Found two huge holes in the block on each side. Oh, so. I know, right? This is the top. This is the block. Jesus. And then this is the top of the piston. So. That's not a good sign. No. This is gonna not gonna just be a simple oil change like I thought it'd be. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, I tell you what, the jokes keep me from going insane. I tell you right now. So we definitely need a short block. <laughs> we definitely need pistons, obviously. Um, 
we just don't know. I don't know how if the heads are damaged, and I don't know what else is damaged because probably won't be. Yeah. I, if it's just a short, yeah. If it's just, we have to say we only hope it's just a short block, and then we just get a short block, and we just you know go crazy with it. But oh, this is so. This is the autopsy, guys. Here it is. This is the autopsy. Wow. Cupcake, really? <laughs> oh gosh. Yeah, that 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 I was just hoping for. I was hoping. Yeah, this is. That's huge. the pan rail. So. Yep. So the the cylinders are gone. Cylinder, yeah. Cylinders block, and it's got to hope the heads and blower are okay. Yeah. Now uh, the the head probably has damage. Okay. Whether it can be recovered is up to L and M. L and M, or you know whoever. So. Okay. Whew. So we're gonna guys, we're gonna come back on in a few days. We're gonna take the blower out and inspect that, and then after that, we're gonna take the entire motor out and send it to L and M. To yep. start the process so what i'll do now I'll, let me try to grab some e85 and throw it in a um water bottle and i'll test that and then uh yeah looks good up top here <laughs> a, lot less oil. a lot less oil so I'm screwed. I'm screwed, screwed. This is gonna be like, this has the potential to be like 10s, 20s, 30, I don't know. It's gonna be so many thousands of dollars to fix this. <sighs> oh, so obviously we put on a lift. I just wanted to see if, how the block was. The block is not even a block anymore. And uh, we're gonna come back and then we're gonna take the blower off, see the blower is okay. And then we're gonna take the motor out and then, listen, enter the window Raptor, please grab, grab a hoodie or a hat, I need help. This is bad, this is bad. And I, first time ever blowing a motor had to be this one. <sighs> what the autopsy. Yeah, I'm weird. Deal with it. That'll rub out. If you guys don't realize, I use comedy because I'm dying inside. But, uh, it's my $100,000 Mustang here. Good stuff. Look at this. Goodness. Goodness gracious. Ugh.